Ladies, gentlemen, welcome back to another week in GTA Online. This week, I bring good news because Kai Rico didn't get nerfed again. So, you know, you don't have to worry about that. Uh, jokes and sarcasm aside, your podium vehicle for this week is the Greenwood and the prize ride is the Neon. All you have to do to win the Neon is place top two in any of the Los Santos car meets. It races three days in a row. My advice for this one is to use a friend and then just do a street race and both of you should be getting progress for that every single time you complete the race. For bonus money this week we have a double cash and RP on the special cargo sale missions, Condemned Slasher, Slashers, Lost vs Damned, the Halloween a Bunker series and Alien Survivals. Yes, GTA Online is entering its Halloween period because there's also triple cash and RP on the Halloween mode that was released last year called Judgment Day. If you didn't get a chance to play it last year, I guess give it a try. It's not the most amazing thing ever. It's okay, but it's an adversary mode that has the adversary mode curse it's kind of unbalanced but it is fun for a round or two and that's pretty much it definitely not something to make money with though if you were one of the lucky folks who filled up a special cargo warehouse last week then i guess now it's time to sell especially consider selling in those public lobbies for that fat stack of high demand cash bonus you should be walking away with about five million if you do so for a large full warehouse of course for discounts there is 40 percent of special cargo warehouses so if you don't have a second large warehouse yet that it might be worth investing into also 40 percent off the rc bandito with modifications and upgrades the massacro soroso torero exo reaper and infernus classic and 20 percent off the monstrosity out of those vehicles the soroso is definitely a fun vehicle to drive though not on the top of its class it definitely doesn't really compete with the krieger and the like but it is definitely a fun vehicle to have within your collection the massacro one of my personal favorites it's definitely not up there anymore but still worthwhile to have especially for its price tag Terrell exo a beast within stunt races some might even wonder why but the acceleration in those tubes is unmatched definitely one of those sleeper vehicles that some people might not actually know about the monstrosity one of the best uh, off-road vehicles in the game especially if you get hsw upgrades on it this becomes a very useful vehicle as well in free roam definitely worth grabbing if you don't have it yet hsw upgrades is not a discount so they will still run you another million or so excluding additional upgrades and finally about the monstrosity you definitely want to avoid getting the large back wheels in the back of your car because if you do so you will no longer be able to uh, use weapons while driving it keep that in mind please and finally, the removed vehicles this week you can grab at the Luxury Autos is the Vaca, and at Simeon's showroom you can grab the Reaper. Neither of these vehicles are really something that I'm going to be screaming that you have to go and grab them. They're okay, but they're definitely on the bottom half of the class. Aside from that, that is for this uh, rather light week in terms of things going on. At least nothing got nerfed or destroyed this week. So I guess, you know, something to calm down to. Apparently, there's also some new uh, stuff coming to the game in form of some Halloween content and some uh, rare sightings or whatever. Not entirely sure what it is, but I'm assuming some of the drift feed stuff that is yet to come out to the game uh, obviously more about that tomorrow when the event week does go live if you're watching this on a wednesday if not then just check the youtube channel regardless i'm sure i'll already have a video up if applicable with that said that was it for this one thanks for watching leave a like subscribe become a member like chloe gta plus and notorious jam and thank you also very much for watching and i'll see you all later